Today's devotion is based on Psalm 103, starting at verse 10. He does not deal with us according to our sins, nor repay us according to our iniquities. For as high as the heavens are above the earth, so great is his steadfast love toward those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, so far does he remove our transgressions from us. As a father shows compassion to his children, so the Lord shows compassion to those who fear him. He knows our frame and remembers that we are dust. What do you know? The, the correct answer is not much. What we do know is that we have a Lord who has redeemed us and holds us in his hands. John 10 tells us that he knows us and he calls each of us by name. If we were his impersonal subjects, we would have cause to fear. Were he a proud, domineering ruler, we would have reason to tremble. But we have a God who knows us. His wisdom is past our understanding. He knows all things, and most important, he knows us. He knows us better than we know ourselves. The text says he knows that we are dust. He knows that we are sinners. He knows that we are mortal. Yet he still considers us priceless. The universe makes us look like a grain of sand, and yet he sees us as the crown of his creation. Though our sins present us as enemies and rebels, he sees us as sheep for whom he is willing to die. The text says he sees us as children, and he's a father who has compassion on his children. He knows who we are and what we are not. He knows us as children of the Heavenly Father. He had each of us in mind when he came to redeem us and make us his own. There are so many things in life that we don't know. The death and resurrection of Christ is the basis for all that we do know about God and his plans for our lives. And that is a foundation for life and for death. We pray. Prime God, thank you for giving us the privilege of calling you Father. Thank you for the gift of your forgiveness. And thank you for calling each of us by name. In Jesus' name we pray.